Hello, welcome to my YouTube channel. Myself, Dr. Madhuryan Srinivas. I'm board certified dermatologist from India, discussing dermatology related topics, MCQs in this YouTube channel. So, if you are new to this YouTube channel, I would uh, request you to just subscribe to this YouTube channel so that you will get all the latest updates of the videos which I will post. And every day we will look at a good thought and this is our today's good thought. If you hang around with five confident people, you will be the sixth. If you hang around with five intelligent people, you will be the sixth. And if you hang around with five millionaires, you will be the sixth. And the same holds good for you hanging around with idiots or unnecessary people. Okay, so be very cautious with whom you are hanging around with because that is going to decide our fate. And this is the MCQ for today. A patient has onychomycosis, he should be prescribed a nail lacquer containing. So what do you think is the answer? Is it amaralfin? Is it cycloparox olamin? Or, or is it terbinafin? If in case you have thought it is option D. So if you have thought any of the above is the answer, you are correct. So let us look uh, briefly about this question. So in the question it is mentioned that onychomycosis which simply means Onycho is nail and mycosis is fungal infection. So fungal infection of the nail is called as onychomycosis. And what is a nail lacquer? So it is a, a costly dermatological word to simply say that nail polish. But since it is medicated, uh, you know, nail polish, it is given this special name called as nail lacquer. And uh, so this nail uh, uh, fungal infection which you are able to see in the format of whitish yellow discoloration present over the lateral part of the nail, lateral part of the nail and slightly distal part being inward. So this type of onychomycosis is uh, called as DLSO that is distal lateral subungual onychomycosis subungual onychomycosis which is in short called as DLSO and it is the, in fact the most common type of onychomycosis and the details about all the types of onychomycosis has been discussed in the previous video the link for which I will leave it uh, in uh, this area and treatment for onychomycosis will be both oral and topical combination will be used and orally we prefer to use terbinafin over etraconazole. And in the topical preparation, uh, we cannot use creams or ointments because nail is very, very, uh, you know, hard and it will not uh, allow any active ingredients to penetrate through its uh, surface. So we use what are called as nail polish or nail lacquers, nail lacquers. So, what are all the nail lacquers which can be used? You can remember with the help of this simple mnemonic A, C, T. So, where A stands for amaralfin, C stands for cyclopyrox and T stands for terbinafin. So, amaralfin, cyclopyrox and terbinafin, the percentages are also in the same order of increasing 5, 8 and 10 percent respectively. And not only uh, these, but also there are newer agents that is ephinaconazole 10 percent and tavaborol 5 percent. These also are available in the form of the nail uh, lacquers. So you can see cyclopyrox, tavaborol, amaralfin and ephinaconazole. Uh, terbinafin is in the trial. So most likely it will hit the market soon. So this is the tomorrow's uh, question. Colpitis macularis is seen in which STD? So do leave your answer in the comment section. I will check your answers. And uh, if you wish to join the uh, awesome Telegram, Instagram, YouTube groups for dermatology related discussion, you the links will be there in the description. Just uh, open the description and join with the help of all the links. And if you have any particular topic uh, of difficulty, doubt, which you want to dis me to discuss, you can leave the topic uh, name in the comment section. And I thank you so much for watching this video till this point. Please do like this video if you enjoyed this. And do remember to subscribe to my YouTube channel and also to hit the bell icon. And uh, you can check out my previous videos here. This is Dr. Madhuryan Shinwas, your dermatology educator on the YouTube channel. And uh, thank you so much for all your patient listening. Happy learning dermatology. Sarvejana Sukhano Bhavandu.